All clear on pit exit. OK, Frank, we've got a five minutes to get the job done. Anything else you'd like to say, Jim, before I start my intro? No? OK. All right, well, good afternoon, race fans. Um, welcome to Charlotte Motor Speedway for the K5 NIS Craftsman Truck event. Um, Looking forward to this one. It's uh, another just mile and a half. Nothing real special about Charlotte, but I um, feel like we might have a little bit of pace. I'm not real sure. We do have some some winds that affect us going down the back stretch. As you'll notice our speed does not. Oh, we're in a pretty good set here, though. It's pretty decent. Wins in practice were a little bit harder. It's tough to get over 177. That exit is going, to exit out of four is going to hurt us just a P3. little bit. Come on, hang on to it here. Good, ease it out of two. Didn't get a great run out of two. I had the truck crank down a bit too much, too much wheel in it. All the grip is kind of right there, down on the stripe. You yeah. want to watch your water temperature. It's looking a little high. 29.9. 68. I will take it. It's almost the tenth faster than I could practice. So, that's awesome. Um, track's a lot cooler. Wind is still up there at 16, coming out of the northeast. So, cool. We'll see where that, that shakes us out. And um, I, I think we got a, a pretty healthy list of entries this evening. So, I don't know how many are actually going to make the feature. Um, he says qualify, 55 will make the feature. But I, he had, I don't believe that Nick has any intention of fielding that many trucks. I believe that... The people that were, that don't qualify in will be DQ'd. All right, Frank, your water and your oil are so both looking pretty hot right now. Run. Try and take it easy. Thanks, Jim. So that we don't have to run the, um, the heat race. So anyway, get back to you um, after we see how things shake out. All right, guys. Nick said two pace laps. Good luck. Yeah, good luck, everybody. <clears throat> Turn left, go fast. Good luck, everybody. It's been a while since you got on here. Good luck, everybody. All right. Let's go. 134 laps at Good luck, Charlotte is what we are looking to complete. P12, the track temp is 70, the air temp is 67 Fahrenheit. Well, starting setup here. Thank you, Jim. Yeah, we're rolling Follow off. Follow car number 11 in the inside column. We're rolling off P12 this evening. Um, it says delay okay, Frank, green let's up get this at the right. top no fuck because up. Nick is... Thanks, Jim. I'll try not to fuck this up. Catch um, up to car number Nick has given us an extra pace lap so that we don't have to, like, play catch up. Like, because so, the back half of the field is just leaving that little formation right now. So, um, we're going to let them get all caught up. We have a full 36 in the field tonight. Um, handful of new members. Shane is back for another race. He hasn't been around for a little bit. Good to see him back. And, um, yeah, just excited to be in the top half of the field again. For a uh, pretty solid qualifying effort. Um, 
We're running the OSR set from Brandon this evening, so thank you for that, Brandon. It's a pretty, pretty well balanced set. Um, ran some practice sessions in it, and I believe I, I didn't run any practice sessions with a track temperature this low. I'm How many is in the gonna assume that this is going to thirty-six. Yeah, thirty-six. Um, that's gonna save us a little bit of tire, but this set wears them fairly evenly. I just got to be able to keep the back end free a little bit so that I don't start to push. It should get loose um, right around 20 laps in. As the fuel burns off, we can oh, go a little over 50. Truck I think it's like 30, yeah, 34, 30 Listen to what they're saying. A little over 50 laps on a tank and the track, I don't believe, is abrasive enough to kill the tires in that well, time. So we shouldn't have to save a whole lot. Just need to keep the truck balanced and not let it plow. I think part of the problem with um, me blowing the right I front. Two months off, I got like first race jitters. In the, yeah, I can understand that, Shane. Ah, uh, you got it, Shane. Missed you, buddy. I did see open last night, and my trading paints crashed, and every single truck had my paint scheme, so thank God it's not that way tonight. That would suck. So anyway, I forgot what I was saying, was but um, <laughs> let's take the green and just get in a groove. It's a lot of last guys. Go, go, go! Okay. Car down yep. low. Heck of a start. Hold your line. Still there. You're clear low. Good job. We just can't get lo loose out of four. That's really what's going to kill us. It's loose out of four. We can keep the truck kind of down on that on the stripe. P11. Down on the blue line, pretty tight. Oh, oh shit! Car outside. Save You're that clear shit, high. Vincent. Save that shit. Outside. Clear. Outside. Right. Outside. Ooh, wee. Saved Hold it. Line. Clear outside. <clears throat> worried about being loose at a four, but I should be uh, worried about P19. loosening the, the transition to two because I was trying to I was trying to pull the truck back down, and it's way too early to try aggressive steering like that. So now I've got some chores. Um, I didn't bend it, and I didn't. Um, didn't collect anybody else. I was able to keep it down. So, oh, all right. Let's focus up. Let's relax. We don't need to be passing anybody right now. So, I mean, 19th sucks. But we can be thankful that we only lost a handful instead of being parked on pit road right now. So. We'll tap on the wall. Not, nothing to be too concerned about. That, that's what happens, though. Is you'll, you'll get those. The exit of four, that big black logo. I think it's the NASCAR logo. I'm not sure. That one right there. Right there. Cup Series logo. We'll reach up and grab you sometimes.
feels like everybody's rolling pretty decent. Um, one thing we need to be mindful of too is as we enter and exit the corners is that big fat seam in three and four. That will make the truck V19, good lap. That's your best in the session. Seam in one and two, you can see it's very small. It's just off to the right side of the truck there. We're crossing it now. And um, in three and four, it's just... It's that big old fat band of filler they've got in there. It sucks. It's a bit greasy. kind of feel like I might have been the only excitement that we had in the opening laps there. Let's return on in the evening. Like I said, um, everybody seems pretty settled in and there's a really good chance we're going to be making green flag stops. So I did practice a handful. Your lap time was at 30.62. What it will be like doing a green flag stop um, on old, old, old tires, but I have an aggressive line and a pretty conservative line that I can run to get in, so. Little loose moment. Uh, no kids today. We had meetings all day. PIR day for the district. We had a we had a meeting. Um, they called in the whole K5 team and district wide. And my school and one other school were recognized. We got a little bit of a bit that of a wad up going here. Point zero zero. Um, we're recognized for our PLC work. We've got a full course caution. Watch out. Okay. So anyway, we're we were recognized Race cars for our out. PLC Line work. Line up single file behind car number two thousand and four. I got by the K5. We're under caution. Pits are closed. Thank you, Jim, for uh, my Teacher of the Year award. All that happy jazz, and so it's been a weird Friday. Anyway, we'll figure out what's up. Get back to you um, when we take the green flag. All right, we're coming back to get the green. Um, Nick says lap 30 and 60 for stage points, which is within reach for us right here. We need to turn another. We're on lap 15. We'll get 16 when we take the green and cross the stripe. And that just leaves us 14 more laps till we might get some stage points if we're in the top 10. We can get into the top 10. Now, here's the thing that's going to happen is that the people next to us, the people um, around us are going to want those top 10 spots as well. So things could get a little bit racy here in the next few laps. We'll have to see. Um, I'm not in the racing for the championship or anything, playoffs or anything. So, I mean, they're not super important to me. The thing that I Green want flag. is I want stage points because Rick's like 38 points ahead of me. P12. In this season, this, this uh, series. And I'd like that to be a little bit closer, if you know what I mean. Yeah, I did the math the other day, Rick. Um, you've got me by, I think, 36 in the trucks, 38 in the trucks, and I have you by six in the late models. High side. Still there. Stay with them. Let's see if we can't get under the third. Hold your line. Good order. They're still there. 
Still there, hold on. Still there. Clear up high. There we go. P11, that lap was at 31.21. Yep, Hold see, it. here's Ryan. He wants. You're high. He's smelling those stage points. He's in the running. Oh! There, outside. Still there. Stay with him. Hold your line. Still there. Hold your line. Clear up top. We, uh. <laughs> we, we just got a little bit racy, didn't we? There inside. All right, we got we have Shane inside us, and hold it. V12. Go ahead and hold your line. He's gonna get a nose in because he knows how to do hold that. Hold your line. And they're still there. I'll try to fight him a little bit for it. Still there. Hold on. With ten to go. I don't. I don't think that it's still worth there. It. I'm not in the run, and let's just Clear let it off, and we'll get we'll get tucked in behind him. Straddle the seam as long as I can. There we go. B13. There we go. Hook the bottom. Watch out for that NASCAR Cup logo. Focusing, just trying to focus. Jim, say something. Come on, Jim. Don't be a dickhead now, man. Come on, don't get tight. There we go. Loosen up a little bit. Slide that right rear just a tiny bit. Colton's in behind us. He's going to want the spot too as soon as he can. Got that car inside. Just let him know. Go ahead and take it. I'm not going to race you this early, Colton. You are much quicker. I don't know how he ended up behind me in the first place. Damn. Oh, he's one of the handful that went in to get tires, I think, to get fuel and or tires. Kill us. The P14. Pace here, running 14. Turning the wheel way too much. If I do that, I'm going to need a caution really soon, and I don't want that. I got to chill out a little bit. Take a little bit less aggressive line on entry. Costin spit at time. We have Alexander and Nick kind of battling behind us. time was 31.17. Nope. Oh. 
can't be going that fast through that corner anymore. There was a trick I was pulling off in practice where you you let off real quick on your entrance and then as the truck lands, get back on the throttle and it would um, break the back end free just a little bit. And that would allow, you know, you keep the car a bit looser. Okay, Frank, you've got half your fuel left. Nope, that's gonna kill our run. Here comes Nick. Inside. Still there. Inside. Clear inside, car bottom. Still there. Hold your line. Still there, stay with them. P-17, hold your line. Bottom clear. See, the truck will rotate. It'll rotate. I just have to be patient. That was a 31.59. See, I saw Nick duck down pit road on lap 12, and I was thinking, damn it, I should have gone. And here's what, here's my theory, is he might smell this thing going green a long time, and he just got 12 more laps of fuel that he doesn't have to come in under a green situation. He can wait that much longer. Inside. Clear low. Yeah, good job, man. Yeah, I'm not I'm not gonna raise people yet. Inside, watch it. Clear down low. Should see if I can use the seam to loosen this thing up though. Eighteenth. You've just done a thirty one point eight nine. Am I turning in late into one? There's something. There's something going on there. Okay, Frank. Ten minutes of fuel remaining. Thank you, Jim. That last lap was a 31.40. They've been driving in too deep. But that's it. Yeah, Kevin. Side. You go for it, Kevin. Still there. Inside clear. V19. That lap was a 31.75. The truck is not loosening up late in the run like it did in the warmer conditions. Um, also in traffic will affect it. It's okay. Alright, so now we know we have short run stuff. May need to take it a little bit easier on things because the truck's not getting loose. Yeah, I was ready to ride hard, but I left the spot. Okay, Frank, you've got half your fuel left. Yeah, we've got a plow on the... Got a plow now. Alright, um...
What can we do? What can we do? B19, that lap was a 31.72. No, nope, don't rub the wall. Inside. Tiny clear. rub, that's not going to affect us too much. But yeah, so inside. What the hell was I thinking? Still there, hold on. There, inside. Somebody requested somebody wrecks. Hold it. That's funny. You're clear low, good job. Second place. I just drove it in way too deep. That last lap. And that's counterproductive to what I want to be doing here. Take a little bit of that loose, Gavin, because I am not, man. I'm too, way too tight. I'll try to use the seam a little bit. Yeah, I'm not even loose out of four. There is no sign of being loose. Drove it in too far. I don't know why I keep doing that. I got qualifying on my brain, I think. We should be good for another 15, 20 laps, I'd imagine. Come on, team. I don't think the scene is making me loose either. Running in P22. All right, Frank. We estimate you've got five minutes of fuel remaining. Driving in too far. P22. Just done a 31.91. Right, get, get down there, some bitch. Once again, we're trying not to hit Alan. We successfully did not hit him last time, so try to have that much success with not hitting him again tonight. Actually, the goal is don't hit anything. We rubbed the wall a bit, you know, probably scuffed the paint some, but it wasn't hard. P22. 
2021. Losing pace late in the run. Car up top. Might have burned up. Tires They're still there. Bit. Still there. I'll hold your line. Still there. Still there. Okay, Frank. There's a car exit in the pits. Heads up. Outside clear. You've just done a 32.18. Sorry, Nick. Sorry about that, Nick. Wasn't paying attention. You've just done a 32.16. Two minutes of fuel remaining. Time. Car bottom. Hold your line. Clear inside. That was a thirty-two point three eight. One gallon remaining. You're gonna pit next time. Full course caution. Watch your speed limit in the pits. The pit lane speed limit is 45 miles per hour. Well. We think we'll need to stop again. Um, what I was saying I is, no idea, we're gonna pit next time. Box in five, four, three, two, one. So I think Box we'll now. just go ahead and pit now. And um, ouch. I heard you, James. Ten minutes of fuel remaining. Ouch. Oh well. Um. I think that stupid yellow flag on pit exit got me. All right, well. Yeah, that's the worst. That's really unfortunate. Yeah, I'm going to nickname it the Gavin. It got me. I don't know. Um, it's going to take a bit, but we've got to hang yeah, out and see how really things pan it. out and get what kind of spots we can and all that kind of stuff. So, um yeah, eight minutes before we can leave, and then another eight minutes is going to be. I think that my best bet is to just fix it all. Lead cars pitting. And then see where everybody is and how things have gone. And where the race is, and see if we can um, get back out there and make any spots by turning laps. So. Hey, Shane, what all right, we're um. Let's let's take a look at what happened, right? I mean, the ball, the ball. To ball, to ball. To ball,
that's unfortunate. Ah, uh, see you, Rick. There's a car approaching. Stay behind the white line. Okay, back out on track. Um, There's a car exit in the pits. Heads up. It's not up. crab walking like crazy, like it was when we parked it, so that's good. Um, B32. Let's try to dig our way out of 30 seconds. Scott is nine and a half seconds behind us in the lead. So um, we'll just try to stay out of his way. Try to stay out of everybody's way. That lap time was 31.88. 17 laps down. Back to the F1. and just uh, keep turning laps. I went back and looked at it. You guys have seen it by now, but um, I went back that and looked at it. That time was 31.86. Just, you know, one of those things where you got a truck completely sideways. And, I don't know. I mean, I was thinking low, but then uh, of course I was thinking not just go high because, um, you know, you can stay on the throttle and keep it out of the wall and dive it down to the infield. It's a little bit safer bet for your gear. You know, you're not going to bash it against the wall. So, I don't know. Um, I was thinking outside again, and I need to not think outside because that's, I mean, it's the trajectory of the truck, right? When you don't have... When the tires are in a slide, they're only B32. accelerating the truck in one direction, and that's straight back. So it's slowing the truck down, and you're just going to careen off where, like, tangent to the point where the tires started to slide, and that will inevitably okay, Frank, put you on the outside which looks wall. quite high. B29. So, that was a um, 32.00. No. something you know it's, it's kind of elementary physics your first guess should be inside especially when you're coming around a corner you know I mean reckoning the trial is a little bit different but not much that lap was a 32.00 Scott's got four and a half to us Oh, we're not. We're not going fast at all. We don't need to be letting up in the corner all that. But we can mash it. We have enough arrow damage. P28. Your lap time was a 31.81. times are improving. This is exactly what we need.
Yep, just mat down. You've just done a 31.68. Oh, one of these days, I'm going to um, get a little bit better run, and then it'll be late in the race, and I won't know what to do with myself. Be like, holy shit, there's only 20 laps to go, and I haven't wrecked this mother. But that was yet. a 31.79. Maybe I should intentionally drive across the apron and back up across the track in traffic and cause a big one or so. Scott's two and a half back. Your last lap time was a 31.95. <clears throat> that last lap was a John Baker here. That Actually was went to elementary school with John straight. Baker for a bit. Inside. Still there. I don't think Pretty that's low. the same John Baker though, because that John Baker had one eye that was so bad he had a monocular for it. Like he was legally blind in one eye. Nice guy, though, from what I remember. His dad was our principal. Time was I'll bet this is a ton of fun to watch. And since nobody's going to be watching this section of the video, we'll go ahead and make a special announcement. Um, let's see. Picked a really big booger the other day. Like, fucking big, dude. Like, classic little school, like, invite your friends over to see it big, man. So... That's a special announcement for you. That lap time was 31.90. On lap what, 67 plus 17, 85. We lap 85, special announcement for this race. Your lap, what the fuck, because we're damaged down on power again. Again, but. Let's look at the positives. We are no longer on pit road. It was only 15 minutes worth of damage and nothing blew up, right? So the engine didn't blow up. We were able to get back out on track. So that's good. And the leaders are a half a second behind us. So we're going to go ahead and just take the high side and keep the high side go ahead and stay out of car the way down low. Cleared inside. Car all inside. of these people buy Three down low, low side. 
collect the safer barrier. I wish I could tell you how many times I did that in practice, but I lost count. It's so subtle. So subtle with this graphics package. Inside. Safer barrier just kind of swoops on out there. Uh, we are garbage now. We are garbage again. Carlo. Bottom clear. Inside. Watch it. Inside clear. Oh. I'll move to the high side there, Kevin. You go. Go get that. Inside. Clear inside. Just done a 32.16. The car ahead's pitting now. Twenty-seven. From thirty-second, I think. So pretty good. Twenty-seven. Your lap time was thirty-two point two one. Hello, please. You're pulling away. The gap behind is now eleven seconds. Down low. Still there. I'll hold your line. Hold it. Clear low. Inside. Watch it. Still there. Stay with them. Clear low. Some easiest thing. Inside. Lap cars are supposed to go high. I, you know, I would clear say. Inside. Low side. I'd say that's probably a good idea since. Still there. The hold preferred on. Preferred line is You're the clear low line. Good job. There. Inside. Just allow the preferred line to. Car effects. inside. Inside. Still there. Hold your line. Hold your line. Still there. Clear down low. Twenty-six. It's another spot, by God. Picked up another spot. There's um, Alex decides to bow out. That'll be another one right away for us. If Dan decides to bow out, we're well, six behind you.
All right, Ryan, you have this in the next corner if you want it, and I'm sure you do. Carlo. Hold your line, clear inside. Well, we have one off. Nick Martin. Went off and recovered it. Good job. Let Max buy if he wants it to. Nope, he's going to go ahead and pit. He might have actually missed his, his first the car for the pit entry. Clear low. That happens. But being able to collect it up and get going again, that says something. Nine out of ten people, I think, probably would have just lost it and brought out a caution and pissed off okay, everybody. Okay, Frank, you've got ten road. minutes of fuel remaining. B26. There's a car leaving the pits. We pulled ahead of Alex. There's a car rejoining in front. Pit cycle, the green flag pit cycle. Where in an official race are you gonna see green flag pit cycles like this? Odds are you're probably not. Low side. And that's fresh Clear tires. That's fresh tires. That is crazy. Inside. They're still there. You're clear low. Good job. All right, Frank. As a car exits in the pits, heads up. Inside. Inside, clear. Come on, somebody's got to cause caution here so I can go in for tires and fuel. Call the mix up? Come on, somebody's got to screw it up. Inside, watch it. Bottom clear. I don't Bar mind inside. The green, though. Clear low. I practiced it. I just need a little bit of space behind me is all. Delete is pitting now. Car down low. Clear inside. There, inside. Clear down low. Mm -hmm. Well, one thing that everybody can learn from watching my videos is what it's like to get past the whole bunch. Car bottom. Clear low. That's just 
That shit's amazing to me. Fresh tires on a, on a straight truck. So much faster. Uh-oh. No, no. I don't need another one, man. Let's go. Let's oh, Terry, good job, line. Terry. Inside. Inside clear. Come on. That's pretty fancy. Is a car leaving the pits? Alright, Tyler, you got it this time, buddy. Leader is pitting now. Estimate you've got five minutes of fuel remaining. Oh, shit, sorry. Carlo, clear inside. Sorry about that, Gregory. I didn't see you back there. Car inside. You're clear low. Good job. Inside, watch it. Bottom clear, car down low. Clear low. Inside. Clear inside. Low side. Clear inside. We're going to go ahead and come down this time by, and we're going to use a really super conservative line in. We're not going to fuck around. Full course caution, be careful. Yay! Pace car's out. Line up single file behind car number 25. Pace car is out. Pits are closed. Look at that! Ha ha! I was looking at the last lead last car to find the more fans over. Yeah, I was doing the exact same thing, so I mean, I didn't even, I didn't even catch it. 
Okay, Frank. Your engine temperatures are okay. All clear on engine temperatures. is closed for Dan and I. The leader, Robinson, is pitting. And Dan is going to go ahead and stay out and take the wave around, I'm sure, so... Because he just came out of the pits. That's fun, Colin. See, we have 30... Alright, so I'm 17 down. And yeah, we're right about, about se 16, scary, 17 We've got go. two minutes of fuel remaining. So... Yeah, we're going to have 17 to go when we take the green. I mean, uh, I can pass a couple of people, but they're going to have to be crashed out right now. And I don't see anybody going any more laps down, so... Do we just pull in? Pits are Can't open. be caught from anybody behind us. Oh my god, I just spun on pit exit. I mean, it could be a shit show. I mean, I guess we, we can run probably the next five and see. How the next couple laps goes quick. I gotta go back. Look out for the pit speed limit. See if Dan wrecks out and get one more spot from him. But we'll need to stop again. I think we just call it here. Box and in five, four, three, two, one. Box now. Full tires on the track. They're not warming up quick. Yeah, we're 20 ahead of the person behind us. We're six behind the person in front of us although Ryan is off I think Ryan is off anyway anyway it doesn't matter I'm not I'm not gonna hang out I'm gonna let them race it out um, you can catch the ending on uh, Nick and Gavin's channels and whoever else decides to um, to put it out there and that has been, oh, hang on, moving the seat back a little bit. Um, that's been the K5 Championship Series NIS Craftsman Trucks from Charlotte Motor Speedway. One of these days I'm going to finish a race. Um, no late model stocks on Sunday because we have a championship next week. What are these idle at? At Hickory. So that'll be fun. Looking forward to that stuff. Um, points at the top of the of that series. I'm not are, but I got a little bit of damage. We're kind of close in spots. Right. So, anyway, um, yeah, they idle at yeah, um, we'll go ahead and the arrow damage does affect it. Anyway. Give her a shot again next week. Hope you liked it. Beautiful. <laughs>